Hello everybody! In this video I'll show you how to make these beautiful earrings yourself. To make these earrings you will need flat nose pliers, smooth multi-wire pliers and cutting pliers. You will need the following materials. 4 pieces of steel wire with a length of 20 cm each. 4 rings, 2 wire guardians. 2 ear wire fish hooks, 2 cream beads of 2 mm, 2 beads to hide cream beads, 24 cream beads of 3 mm, and several Swarovski elements. All these materials can be ordered fast and easily at Beach of Fashion. The website is displayed on the bottom of the frame. The Swarovski elements beads are available in different colors, sizes and shapes, so you can make these earrings the way you want them. These earrings are part of the Double Beach Jewelry Kit Downtown LA. This package concludes a clear instruction. The Double Beach Kits can also be ordered on the website of Beach Your Fashion. I have sequenced the items so that it's easier to assemble the jewel. Begin with two pieces of steel wire. Pull those wires through the wire guardian. Now pull the steel wires through one cream bead, but do not squeeze the cream bead. That's because you have to pull the end of the wire through the cream bead later. Now begin with stringing the steel wires to the Swarovski elements. It is important to look which wire is the one on the outside. String the wire on the outside through the round Swarovski elements with a cream bead between them. If you have any problems with the techniques used in the video or if you are just starting to make jewelry, you can find step-by-step -step photographic explanation of several base techniques on the Beach of Fashion website. You can also find other jewelry techniques on the website. You should definitely take a look. Now string the other Swarovski elements beads to the wire. String the Bicon Swarovski elements to this wire, again with a cream bead between them. The Swarovski elements beads make these earrings look chic. If you use bright colored beads, the earrings will look hip and cheerful. But if you use basic colors, the earrings will look very chic. That's why these earrings are suitable for different occasions and outfits. If you have pulled the wires through the Swarovski elements and through the cream beads, pull the wires through the cream bead again. Make sure that between the two wires there's a good distance. 
You can make the distance as big or as little as you prefer. For example, you can make it this way. Get the flat nose pliers and squeeze the cream bead. Always make sure that you squeeze it tight so that both wires are fastened tightly. You can cut the rest of the steel wire carefully with the cutting pliers. This is an accurate action. It's best to cut the wires carefully one by one. The steel wire is now cut off but doesn't look tidy. To finish it tidy, you can use a bead to hide cream beads. Get one of these beads and place it around the cream bead. Squeeze it with flat nose pliers or smooth multipliers around the cream bead. This technique is also explained clearly with step-by-step -step pictures on the technique page on www.beatyourfashion.com The cream bead is now nicely hidden and the bead that hides it looks like a little round metal bead. Next, you can tie the ear wire fish hook with the rings. Get a ring and open it with two flat nose pliers or with flat nose pliers and multi wire pliers. Put the eye of the earring and another ring on this ring and then close the ring with the pliers. Make sure that the ring is fastened tightly. For these earrings, I use two rings to let the earring drape better. Now open the upper ring and attach it to the earring. Close the ring and again make sure that the ring is closed tightly. Your first earring is now complete. You can continue to make the second earring the same way. Use the first earring as an example. To make sure the earrings look the same and have the same size. Good luck on making these earrings. They are true eye catches and are also very wearable. If you want more useful techniques, inspiration and good information, take a look at www.beatyourfashion.com.